Hi folks, this is Max from GalaxyNexusRoot.com and uh, I've got an updated overview of the latest CM10 M2. This is a stable version, the monthly stable versions. Um, this one actually comes with Android 4.1.2, that's right. And you'll see it's a 4.1.2 officially. Um, a lot of a lot of upgrades, a lot of cool stuff. Um, I've changed a bunch of stuff as you can see in my lock screen, you know, my notification bar, and also I can even um, make my screen brighter, going like this. It's so cool, right? Anyway, let me go through all the stuff that I've did to my phone here real quick. Uh, let's go through the first one. Launcher, home screen, grid size. Um, grid size, you can get it up to 5x6. You might be able to get 5x7. Actually, let's try that real quick. That might kind of scrunch everything. Yeah, you can go almost like 5x7, even more, but you'll lose the name of apps. And also, you can put a lot of apps now. Um, so that's really good. And uh, home screen, what else is there? Uh, resize any widget. This is kind of cool. Uh, let me show you an example here. You can resize any widget, like Facebook widgets. Um, you Normally, you can't resize it, but if you change the number of uh, rows and columns, now you can actually get it fit so it looks nice and you can actually read more of the the Arabian letters there. I don't know how to read Arabian. But um, that's really cool. And uh, let's go back to drawer. Oh, nothing important there. General auto rotate screen and go to lock screen. This is pretty huge. Um, screen security. If you want to change the security, you can do it all here. Um, more options in stock, all of that, face unlock, I don't really use it much. Clock alignment, battery status, only when charging, um, owner info, you can put your name there. Weather is great, um, you can use Yahoo Weather, set your location, um, and uh, you'll be able to see it in your lock screen. This is great, right there, San Francisco. And also calendar widgets. Um, before they, they use only have this on the OKP. Now it comes bundled with CM10, which is great. Uh, you can find events from your favorite calendar app. I'm using my Gmail here, and it's going to tell me what I'm going to do for the next whole week. And the view slider shortcuts. This is where you can change the shortcuts. You can change up to four for CM10. Now AOKP ROM should come out soon, which should give you even more options. Uh, Bill 5 should be out soon. I'll have a review of that too, but for now, this is like, you know, awesome still. And themes, you can download any CM10, go type CM10, CM9 themes or AOKP themes, and you know, once you install it, it'll show up here, change your theme there. System, status bar, this is where you can get the um, brightness control, all right? Make sure auto brightness control is turned off and turn this on. And uh, you can be doing this all day. Hi on Android. Hi on Android. Hi on Android. Yeah. And also um, show notification count. Uh, display display number of pending notifications. That's very useful. And also I changed my battery style to percentage. As you can see, percentage. I like that better. Be accurate. And also signal uh, negative at 89 dB decibels. Is that decibels? And uh, let's go keep looking at some more stuff. Notification drawer. Power widget, this is kind of cool. You can add um, your custom uh, widgets, toggles. All right, so let's go at mobile data, orientation, toggle sync, and this is going to be really cool. Power widget, so you can add more you know, toggles, and boom, uh, it's all built in. I love it. Um, optic feedback, all of this stuff, you can change it. It's awesome. And uh, wallpaper, um, you can change wallpapers. Font size for those of you, uh, far, those of you getting older, you know, in the late 50s or early 60s. I know it's hard for you to read. You can set that to larger. Um, power menu, and you can add screenshot there. Navigation bar, this is kind of cool. Unlock it, and uh, you can get. I added additional buttons here and uh, this is the menu button here and I can actually erase it or add another button the menu button and uh, you can customize different buttons so I've got actually five six five buttons here 
search button right there too. So you can customize that. That's really cool. And I think we went all of this, right? Um, theme system. Yeah, we just did the system. And uh, one more thing, advanced. This is really cool. Um, you can change the display and uh, make it the way you tune your your display so you know it will display the way you want. Maybe sometimes you know these LCDs do get old and sometimes they do change colors. And you can kind of you know mess with that to get the best color. Uh, CPU, um, GPU. So here I've overclocked my GPU to 520. 512 megahertz from the defaults. Um, for gamers, definitely set it at 512. And uh, and there's also performance. I won't go into that. Just you know, but we'll just go into it. I've got it overclocked to 1.35 gigahertz. Now you, I think you can get up to now 2 gigahertz on the Galaxy Nexus. Um, you can go ahead and install a kernel over it. I'll try to find a kernel that's compatible with Android 4.1.2. Although any jelly bean should work, um, so that's my lock screen, and uh, of course you do get Google Now for those of you who don't know. You get Google Now cards and also Google Search. San Francisco Giant Score. Aish. San Francisco Giant Score. Okay. San Francisco Giant Score. It works. It's just sometimes really slow. Um, so there you have it, 4.1.2, all of this stuff, um, M2, get it for your GSM, Verizon, or Sprint Galaxy Nexus, uh, certainly one of the best ROMs out there, and also there should be a ton of great ROMs, um, you know, coming on top of this, including Paranoid Android, uh, you know, AOKP, Codename, all of those ROMs will be updated, um, and some of them are already updated. But CM10, great ROM. Certainly one of the best ROMs you can run on your Galaxy Nexus. Oh, and I forgot. Um, the 4.1.2 does give you horizontal um, you know, view there. There you go. There we go. Great ROM. Check it out. Flash it on your Galaxy Nexus and let me know what you think of this latest M2 version. Um, certainly awesome. Awesome. And... Uh, if you, <coughs> you have a Galaxy Nexus, and you have a any of the Galaxy Nexus, GSM, Verizon, Sprint, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynexusroot.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, it's a great way for you to get contact, contact with me, and uh, others. And uh, if you're on YouTube, please hit that like button for me. And subscribe on up there, and uh, have a great week, and stay high on Android, yo. Oh yeah, see y'all later.